Hi everybody, how's it going? Let's try and find a way Welcome back to Uncharted 4. And some sort of a flashback. I get the impression that we're probably going to find out shortly one of the reasons why Nate is so loyal to Sam. Um, we're going to find out more about their story, I think, here. I'm pretty sure the front door will be locked. You never know. It's worth a try. Mm. It's worth it's trying worth try. it. Okay, let's go around the back. Let's look around back, huh? Hopefully there are no dogs in this property. Okay, I see another door. I'm gonna try the back door. Okay, apparently we can't. <laughs> okay, give me your hand. Boost me up. All right, there you go. Can we get in here? I can't jump that high. Okay, we'll use this to jump Follow up. Me. Okay, there's an open window. For some reason. Come on, Nathan. Go on then, after you. Whoa. Spooky. Oh here. I brought a spare. It's not really so, spooky, it's just for the crap. Are we looking for any particular room? Uh, just keep an eye out for any books, journals, any kind of research papers, you know? Okay, what do we have here? Hmm, nothing in here. Found another one. Just more crap. Nope. Yeah, it's not going to be in this attic. The boxes are filled with old traveling and camping equipment. Wait, I found something. Let's read it. Miss Evelyn. My name is Kenichiro Namba. I recently attended your lecture at the Adventurer's Lodge last week regarding your recent find. The set of Tokugawa era armor you obtained off the coast of Okinawa. Your presentation was utterly fascinating, though I was surprised by the condescending tone of the questions from the audience. I believe recognition and respect for one's work should not be contingent on race or gender. I imagine we have both struggled in that regard. I write today because I have come into possession of what I believe to be French jousting armor, though I am not completely certain of the date nor the country of origin. If you have any time to spare, I'd appreciate your insight of someone with your expertise. Apologies if this is too forward, but I will only be in the city for another month. In September, I travel to Iceland to study a Viking burial site, and I would deeply regret missing the opportunity to speak with you further. I'm staying at the Lennox if you wish to contact me. I sincerely hope you do. Kindest regards, Kenichiro Namba. Maybe that coat of arms is important. Huh. Yeah, that'll do. What's he found? What'd you find, Sam? Down we go. Aha! A way out. How are we getting back up there? So, how do we find them? What, Mom's notebooks? I mean, don't you remember? She always used that off white leather binding. Yeah, I know, but. Such a Wait, what? Place. This is our mum's house? Finding a needle in a haystack. Oh, so it's just been left like this, has it? Since they died. Well, did our parents die? I can't even remember. Oh, here it is. White leather. Sam, I think I found one. For real? No. It's not one of mom's. You got the right idea, though. I'll keep looking. 
Okay. Keep looking. There's a door we can go through there. What's hey, this? Call me crazy, but this looks like a Ming Dynasty vase. Nathan, who in their right mind would have a Ming Dynasty vase just sitting around like that? Yeah. It's probably a knockoff of some kind. Yeah, of course it is, right? Right. Not necessarily. Let's go through here. Whose room is this? This house is full of crap, honestly. <laughs> it's another letter of some kind. Let's read it. Dear Eddie, Greetings from Peru. I hope my letter arrived safely. There is no post office here, only a small patch of grass serving as a runway and slow boats up the Manu River. I wish you could have seen the howler monkeys yesterday. Bright orange creatures with expressive faces and ample curiosity. I would not describe the noise they make as a howl, however. It is like a hurricane wind mixed with a lion's roar. Were it not illegal and dangerous, I'd bring home one for you as a pet. Your mum is busying herself with preparations for tomorrow's excursion into the jungle, where we hope to conclude our research. She sends her love. I promise when you're older, we shall bring you on our trips so that you might experience the larger world for yourself. Be good for grandmother, study hard, and we shall see you in a month. Love, Dad. Okay. Hey, these boxes remind you of anything? What boxes? Every place we ever lived. Exactly. I remember Dad was always like, why bother unpacking? We're just gonna move again in a month. Yep. Always the asshole. Okay, I guess we're going through this door then. Yeah. Oh, we'll budge. Here, let's do it together. You ready? Push! Whoa. What the hell? It's some sort of sarcophagus. Yeah. Look around. So this can't be real, right? Sarcophaguses. Or sarcophagi. <laughs> Sam. This is real. So we're doing here. What is this place? Huh? Let's go find out. <laughs> huh? This one's Roman. Third, maybe fourth century. Recognize that one? Uh, I, I've seen something like it before. Reclining figures. It's Etruscan. Ah, uh, that's right. Yeah. Husband and wife, They're buried together. It's kind of dark, and like in an awesome sort of way. <laughs> yeah. Why is this open? This place is like a damn museum. <laughs> Think they've got a dinosaur wing? Wouldn't surprise me. Organ jars. <laughs> cool. Okay, it looks like we've looked at everything we can. We can go down here, though. What do we have down here? It's just stuff everywhere. Okay, let's check this one. It's another, another book. One. No. Nope. I do believe this is an ancient Mesopotamian washer dryer combo. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I was the funny one. Always was. Okay, there's a door here. This house is just full of crap, honestly. 
everywhere. Just crap. They need to do some tidying up. Hey, Nathan, check me out. Now, who am I? Huh? Dr. Livingston! Come on! <laughs> nice. Okay, we're into the kitchen now. Some sort of a note on the, the table. Let's give it a read. Man. Adventurous Lodge. Why would Lodge. you get an invite like this? Flip it. What's that say? It's been a while. I do hope you'll join us this year. Charles. So that must be where the owners of this house are. There's a globe here. Let's give it a spin. So where are we going? Huh? Well, if you could go anywhere in the world, where would you pick? Anywhere? Anywhere. Okay, well... Here we go... India. Yeah, we'll visit the Taj Mahal. Okay, we'll do it again. And she goes. Soviet Union. Let's go to Moscow. Hey, it might be a tad difficult to get in. I always wanted to see the Red Square, though. Hey, how Let's many times again. can we do this? England. Sure would be cool to see Windsor Castle. Right, Sam? Hey, not really, it's kind of don't boring. Look at me. It's not my fault you weren't born yet. It's not like I remember much of it anyways. And it wasn't that cool. Uh-huh. Okay. One last spin. Brazil. Hey, now you're talking. All kinds of undiscovered places in the rainforest. And all kinds of undiscovered tribes with poison darts. Hey, yeah. That too. Okay, what else do we have here? Hey, check it out. <sighs> it's hot in there. <laughs> Fertility totems. Are you a little young to be looking at that stuff? Aren't you a little old to be making that joke? <laughs> okay, what's this? Wow. This table is as big as the ones in the orphanage dining hall. Yeah, I bet the food here was better. <laughs> Wouldn't take much. Damn. They must have thrown some great parties in here. Judging by the artifacts, they certainly had enough money for it. Yeah. Looks like it's been a long time since the last one, though. Okay, hey, we've got some other armor. crazy demon helmet. Is that a Viking helmet? Come on. You know Viking helmets don't have horns? It's Persian. Oh. My bad. Can you imagine being the one to Let's actually this uncover on. these things? <laughs> Must be something, right? Okay, there's another box. Hopefully this is the one. Whoa. Hornets of Arabia. Always wanted to see that flick. Never got around to it, though. Not the one we're looking for. This house is huge. Oh, what's this? Jousting armor. Looks French. Hey, maybe don't go waving your flashlight around the windows too much. Okay. Probably right. Can we go upstairs or? Can. What's in here? Locked? Hmm, it's yeah. locked. Mom's stuff might be in one of these rooms. We gotta find another way in. <sighs> I 
How did Sam get up here? Hey, the air vent up there. No, I'm looking around. A dragon dome. Hmm. Looks like it's from Southeast Asia. Going it alone. Where's the air vent? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That could get us into the room below it. Not us. You. What? I, I can't fit in there. Can you handle it? You kidding me? Can't handle it. All right. Let's see what you got then. How do I get up there? Up the place. Since when do you like classical music? Excuse me, I am a man of many tastes. Oh. Okay, there's something here. A burnt up letter. I think I found a way of it. Allow us our confidence to join its fellows from no. Amenhotep's tomb in our museum. I certainly I understand your reluctance. You did either. beat us to the find after all, but our offer is more than generous, and I can assure you it will be treated and displayed with the proper care and respect due the sarcophagus and the effort undertaken to retrieve it. You have enjoyed its magnificence in your home for years. It's time to share it with the rest of the world. I hope you will reconsider my offer. Your sincerely, Peter K. G. R. Acquisitions. Okay, we're moving this apparently. Are you ready? What's that? The camera. It's a Polaroid. Let me see. I think it still works. Come here. A smile, all right? Don't lose it. Okay, how many times are we going to shake this thing? It's actually getting clearer every time we shake it. Ah, nice. Fall. I'm not gonna fall. What? Well, which way are we meant to go then? Not this way, surely. Well, maybe we do go that way. Or up above? Up above, yeah. Okay. Making our way around the room. Hopefully none of these fall off the wall. Alright, the air vent is up there. Is that an alarm? Is that some sort of an alarm there? Smoke alarm, maybe. I think it's probably a smoke alarm. Okay. It's a good thing I'm not claustrophobic. Fell down. All right. What's all this in here? Okay, I'm in. Can you get the door open? Ah, 
It's locked from this side, too. And look around. Is there a key nearby? Okay, I'll have a look. <sighs> Coding. Lots of painkillers. These like hospital machines? Like medical machines, I think they are, aren't they? Okay, let's read this. Evelyn. I was hoping I wouldn't have to write this letter. I was hoping our last conversation made my intentions clear. I was hoping that you're ignoring I was sorry, I was hoping that ignoring your repeated attempts to contact me would eventually send the right message. Discovering you sent my daughter a check in the mail means the message was too subtle for someone like you. I don't need your money, and more to the point, I don't want your money. I can take care of my family just fine without your help. It's insulting to both of our intelligences to pretend that your hollow gesture would somehow rekindle our relationship. What little was left of our bond died the moment you couldn't bother to show up for Dad's funeral. Right up to the moment he drew his last breath, last breath he still loved you. I don't. I pray you find peace of whatever it is you've been seeking your entire life, but do not contact me or my family again. Edmund. Well, that's sad. Where's this key? Huh. There it is. Got it. Okay, let's unlock this door so we can get Sam in here. So, anything? Didn't see any journals. All right, well, we still got the other locked door, so come on. Can we use the key on the other door as well? Apparently we can. Wow. Uh, journals galore. Well, let's see what we find. Okay, here's a box. It might be in here. Whoa. <laughs> Sam. You got something? This is it. Which is <laughs> a paradise. Okay. Evelyn bought a first edition of A General History of the Pirates from a collector, along with a stack of 18th century documents. Among them, I found a very intriguing letter from one John Bur uh, sorry, Joseph Burns, who not only admits to being a crewman on Henry Avery's ship, but possibly hints at Avery's vast treasure. What else could Riches of Paradise refer to? If he sent this letter from prison, he clearly didn't have the treasure with him, so where is it? I need to trace it back to the source. Henry Avery's attack on the Gunsway. What are these markings? That note above the letter, what are these markings? Whoa. Henry Avery. Gunsway heist. So this is how we found out about it then. I've never seen this one. Yeah, me either. But that you know, that's definitely mom's handwriting. Put up your head. Oh shit. Slowly. Hey, There's someone here. There's no need for that. What is he holding? Hey, hey, you keep your gun on me. Give me my journal. <laughs> all right, all right. Wait, is that our mum? I'm sorry, Nathan. So what now? Now. We wait uh, for the police. Yeah, you don't want to have to deal with that headache. Stop. I mean, the hassle of ruining two kids' lives, that's... 
I really don't want to shoot you. Come on, lady. It was no harm. No foul, all right? We all must face the consequences for our actions. Hm. And at least let him go. I brought him down here so he could see our mom's stuff. That's it. He had nothing to do with this. What? I'm telling you that this is all on me. No. Your mother's stuff. Yeah, the, that journal. It was our mom's. You're Cassandra Morgan's boys. Uh. <gasps> hi? My God. <coughs> I could have shot you. Yeah, you're still nice, so, uh. Do you mind? Who is this woman? Is this on Nan or something? Okay, maybe stop smoking if you're, like, dying and stuff. You knew her mom? She worked for me. As I'm sure you've noticed. I'm a collector of sorts. <laughs> That's sort of an understatement. So... Mom was like your translator? Your mother... was the most brilliant historian I have ever met. Huh. We could have accomplished so much together. But then her illness... It... I'm sorry. No, it's all right. Happened a long time ago. Of all her discoveries... This would have been her crowning achievement. Sick Parvis Magna. Greatness from small beginnings. Sir Francis Drake's motto. Yeah, Latin and historical figures. <laughs> Those were our dinner conversations. We were uh, a weird family. Did she ever tell you her theories regarding Sir Francis Drake and his heirs? Uh, Sir Francis Drake didn't have any heirs. Yeah. That's what history tells us. But your mother and I believed otherwise. Learning that old pirate's secrets is just one more adventure I have to let go. I guess there's a lot I have to let go. <laughs> Forgive me. Ramblings of an old woman. Here. It is as much yours as it is mine. Who knows? Perhaps one day you'll be able to finish what she started. Perhaps. Wait, you actually called the police? Yeah, sure. Uh, we're off the hook, right? I'll handle the police. You found your way in. I trust you can see yourself out. Hmm? Yeah. Uh, Here. <sighs> Thank you. Sorry about the mess. <laughs> All right, come on, Nathan. Let's go. <laughs> She's gonna die. Are you okay? Holy shit. Hey. 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 Oh shit, another police are here. Stan? Stan? Oh, the police. You all right? Wait, we have to do something. Yeah, we need to get the hell out of here. You can't just leave her here. There's nothing we can do for her. All right, we have to run. If the cops find us here, then this. Ma'am? Nathan! We gotta go. Right now. Okay, we've got to escape the police now. Okay. You, check up there. You, come with me. Well, this isn't something I was expecting to have to do. Shit. 
Haven't heard back from the guys inside. It's a big place. It might take a while. Yeah. Sam! I got you. Just jump. Are we gonna get caught? Something tells me we're gonna get caught. And one of us is gonna end up getting arrested or something. Come on. Come in. Someone's gonna fall, right? After us. Yeah, right. Like they're gonna shoot a child. Wow, these police are fucking stupid. Wait, we're going back up to the house. Fuck off. We're children. You're not going to shoot a bunch of children, are you? Fuck off. Sam, pull me up. That's right, we're getting away. Quick, on the bike. Yes, we got away. Fuck the police. I'd say we're clear. But we catch our breath for a second. wasn't our fault back there. I mean, that lady, she... She was, um... Sick. I mean, it's okay to feel bad. But there was nothing we could do about it. So what are we gonna do now? I can't go back to the orphanage. You can't go back to your job. Then we don't. Sure. No, I'm serious. We get as far away from this place as we possibly can. Yeah? And how long till the cops find us? Well, I think they'll be looking for Nathan and Samuel Morgan. Yeah, that's us. What if it wasn't? Nathan, back at that mansion, you knew just as much about that stuff as that poor old lady. Here. I always felt that we were destined to for something great. But until tonight, I didn't know what that meant. But this, Mom's unfinished work, this is our chance to restart our lives with brand new identities. What are you talking about? Well, I know some guys. Pretty good at forging papers, too. Now, as for our new name, Mom believed that Sir Francis Drake had heirs. Who's to say he didn't? You're serious, aren't you? Nathan, we were meant for this. And I promise, you and me together, we're gonna go far. So we just made it up, basically. So what do you say? We're not Sir Francis Drake's Nathan heirs Drake. at all. We just decided that we were. Where are the 
really changed after that. You know, we became explorers, adventurers, mostly thieves. Ow. Okay, just hold still. You know, for a while it felt like you know, if we weren't taking turns going to jail, it was because we were in jail together. After I lost him, I, after I thought I lost him. I, uh, you didn't want to bring him back up again. Something like that. Well, that's it. Now you know everything. With you, I doubt that that's everything. But it's a lot. Love to know what you're thinking. I'm thinking that you're lucky that I found you when I did. Yeah. How did she know you were here anyway? I'm glad you didn't lose a limb or anything. It would have been a royal pain getting you out of here. How did you uh, find me anyway? Oh, you know, easy. Just follow the sound of gunfire. <laughs> no, I mean, how did you get here? Oh, of course. <laughs> Come in, Sully. Ah, oh, good old Sully. <laughs> How's he doing? Oh, you know, he's banged up, but he's alive, par for the course. And now we just need to rescue the other Drake. I'll let Nate tell you. Hey, pal. Glad you could join us. Yeah, I wouldn't miss it. So what happened to Sam? Rafe's got him. Oh, shit. You know where they are? Uh, yeah. They're headed to the northern side of the island. See if you can find a place to set down over there. Once we get Sam, we're gonna need to get out of here pretty quick. Copy that. Hey, hey what about the treasure? Forget it. We don't need it. But Alcazar? No, there is no Alcazar. It's all bullshit. Wait, you mean the dip, the... The escape? Yeah, Sam made it all up. What an asshole, right? Look, I'll fill you in on everything when I see you, okay? Yeah, I can't wait. But you should be <laughs> safe down there. You know us. JJ. Okay, we have a gun. Sure. It's time to get okay. Sam back. Thanks for saving me. Again. I almost didn't this time. Right. Come on. I got us a ride. So, we're headed to the northern side of the island? Yeah, New Devon. It's home to the founders of Libertalia. And that's where Rafe is taking your brother. The treasure's probably there. Just need to save Sam before they find it. Okay. That's where we're going to leave it. So, we found out a bit more about their history then. Turns out, our name isn't Drake at all. It's all fake. But there we go. So... We've got to now go and find Sam, which we'll do in the next episode. So, as always, guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, click the like button. Make sure you subscribe to the channel if you're new. And I'll see you all next time.